Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to show you exactly how to set up a session indicator on TradingView, using what I truly believe is the best one available as we head into 2025. By the end of this video, you'll have a clean, clearly defined chart that highlights the key market sessions with ease, and you'll understand not just how to set it up, but why each setting matters. So if you're someone who wants to make session timing a bigger part of your trading strategy, or you just want your charts to be a bit more organized and readable, you're in absolutely the right place. Let's get right into it. So the first thing you'll want to do once you're inside TradingView is tap on the indicators section. It's that little button, usually at the top of your chart, labeled indicators. Sometimes it looks like a little bar chart or a magnifying glass. Go ahead and give that a click. This brings up TradingView's vast library of possible tools, and I know it can feel a tad overwhelming with all the choices, but don't worry, we're heading right where we need to go. Next, in the search bar that appears, type in the word session. What you'll notice is a list of various session-related indicators popping up. What we're specifically looking for is the indicator from Luxalgo. Their session tool stands out because it's exceptionally clear and customizable making it ideal for tracking different market openings and closes without cluttering your chart with unnecessary visuals. Once you spot it on the list, just click to add it directly to your chart. Now, once the indicator is applied, you're going to see a few default visuals, maybe some lines segmenting your chart or colored boxes marking out sessions. This is great, but we can make it a whole lot clearer. To do that, click on the settings icon right next to the indicator's name. This will open up a menu where you can really tailor how the indicator appears and behaves. From here, scroll all the way down to the very end of the settings menu. You'll see an option labeled Show Daily Divider. By default, it's likely checked, which can add extra lines or visual separation for each day on your chart. For most traders, though, this can start to look messy, especially if you're focused more on sessions than individual days. So go ahead and uncheck that box. Don't worry if your chart suddenly looks a bit emptier. What you're doing here is removing unnecessary noise so you can really zero in on what matters. Up next, we're going to make the sessions themselves less visually overpowering. Still in the settings, find the transparency option. It might be under color or style settings depending on your version, but with a little scrolling you'll see it. Change the transparency to 79%. What this does is make the highlighted session areas more subtle, they'll be visible, but they won't dominate your chart. It's like dimming the light in a room so you can actually read what's on the page, instead of being blinded by the glare. Now, scroll up in the settings menu to the section where you can adjust the color. By default, one of the session boxes or highlights might be set to yellow. For many traders, yellow can be a bit harsh, especially on different chart backgrounds. So what I like to do, and what works beautifully for a sleek modern chart, is change that yellow to black. Not only does this give your chart a cleaner, more professional look, but it also makes the important price data stand out more clearly. Once you've made those adjustments, just click OK to save all your changes. Take a moment to look at your chart. You should see clearly marked session areas, nothing distracting, and everything easy to read at a glance. This setup helps you focus on timing and session-driven opportunities without any confusion. And that's it, you've set up your Luxalgo session indicator in a way that really lets your analysis shine. If you found this tutorial helpful, please give it a like, and don't be shy about dropping any questions or feedback in the comments below, I love hearing from you. And if you want more step-by-step -step guides to level up your trading, make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss a video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.